All right, welcome to the first of other known uh, play testing the campaign roguelite thing mod. Uh, so <coughs> do uh, th this is a living document because uh, I already found some things I wanted to change. So, I don't know. Um, so this is version 1.4.9. And it fits on 22 pages. Um, the last page is very handy dandy because it has the thematic circum circumstances uh, table. Uh, so you can look it up and it has the battle map reference. Uh, so you can check uh, easily what everything does. Um, it is one entire digital document. Uh, so the only thing what you do is you uh, look it up uh, in a digital version in uh, whatever you are looking for in the um, in the uh, physical version, and uh, then you have all the def all the documentation that you want. Um, I'm assuming that you read the rule book. Uh, but never got it to play, and then you're not alone. Uh, so preparation, uh, we are going to see how far we get, but I think mission zero should be feasible. Um, what to shuffle, have the game components prepared as described in the read me first, um, more or less. Uh, then shuffle the power up deck thoroughly and put it back into the tuck box. Uh, that is the power up deck is here. And I already shuffled it because it's, uh, it's boring to pre present. Uh, then shuffle the fragment deck thoroughly and put it back into its tuck box. Uh, so fragment and destinations. Uh, and I shuffled both. Well, destinations, uh, uh, you should keep the destinations sorted by color. Uh, so it's a set of red, blue, yellow, etc. Um, sort the circumstance deck for retrieving cards rolled from the table. Uh, we're going to do the thematic <coughs> circumstances, as I said. Uh, so the circumstances here. I was using uh, paper wrappings <coughs> for the circumstances, but uh, in hindsight it's far easier to just consult the table. And the only th the, the, the optimal thing would be to have wood nymph. Yeah, so to put these things into alphabetical order. So it's A, Nixie's Invitation, Aggressive Thicket, Animated Statue. And these uh, um, upgraded artful car color cards, they have the drawback that uh, they have an even distribution. So 1, 2 is this effect, 3, 4 is this effect, 5, 6 is this effect. This was previously 1, 2, 3, 4, 2, 5 and 6. So the, the 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 last would be the least um, probable, and they changed this because in sense of Shurax some of these last effects uh, they didn't occur often enough, so they changed everything uh, the alternative would be to either go back to the to the artless version or to the uh, yeah to fix every probability range uh, by using uh, stickers or something which nobody yeah they are both not very ideal or just to make peace with the fact that everything is now equally random uh, so we have now the Circumstance de de deck sorted. Uh, all 
Okay. Um, sort the big re the uh, leave the relic cards in the box. Sort the big uh, hex tile boards, night nexus, able E to N on a single pile nearby. Oh, we can do that. Um, it's, it's also let's see. Uh, You have this set, which doesn't look random at all, uh, but it will be useful later. Something like this. Okay, so we put it nearby. And Take out the battle mat. That mat. Okay. Uh, start each game on starter difficulty until you defeated the Magi on starter. After you defeated the Magi on starter, start each game on easy difficulty. Take the battle mat and cross off the starter difficulty lower left. Um, yeah, well, you can also remember that. Uh, yeah, the game it, it itself adjusts difficulty during a run, so do not increase it on your own. Record the initial difficulty on your scoring row, section 5. So the scoring row is here. And difficulty is already set at starter. I think I need a pen soon. Uh, then these four large. No, wait. Uh, 1.3 the map spine. Uh, the real world of FOA starts out with four large connected pieces that together form the core area onto which a smaller areas will be added. Create the map of the four quadrants as follows. For your first uh, game, uh, set A, B next to each other and C, D under it. Um, maybe I should add keep the orientation, but uh, this is what was the intent. Uh, it's something like this. Okay. Well, they stick nicely together. Um, let's see if you can see it. Maybe I need to zoom out a little bit. Like so. Okay. Uh, yeah, so that's the map spine. Um, for your first game, yes. For your li for later game, uh, games roll a random configuration from the map configuration booklet, and the map configuration booklet is something like this. Um, and if you roll something with random, then you have to put the car um, tiles like so. And you can see there are also smaller things uh, which will be added later. Um, Yeah, okay. Uh, take the smaller hex boards. Uh, one of the, uh, them is uh, the, 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 the Fey Realm, so put it as aside. Uh, in a later instruction, I said to put the Fey Realm face down because all the portals are closed. So I'll do that right now. 
Um, then roll for Acropolis uh, starting side. Some little uh, introduction and then uh, now that is exactly the instruction. Uh, roll the one to die. It's uh, even more precise than I intended. Uh, okay, roll the one to die. Uh, it's a one. Uh, so the Acropolis, where are you? Acropolis starts on city one. Uh, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, so it goes like so. That's nice. Uh, I think this is better lighting. Uh, Then generate a hero. Um, a hero sheet has 10 attributes and a bar for food or food consumption. Draw a random class. Yeah, D8, use schools out. Okay. Uh, D8, where are you? Uh, I have the D6 and D8, and as these destination things in one bag, that's more practical can recommend it um, okay roll of the eight it's an eight of course uh, schools out is here um, And it shows all the base game uh, because this is, is only for base game. Uh, I refuse to buy into all the products before I got a first shot at making this workable. So it's a warden. Um, so we take the warden. Enemies, game turns, battle. I think this is the heroes. Doesn't drive war 